breakfast at the Moose Lodge. All you can eat. Yeah. Yuck, no spam. <laughs> Yuck. That is heart attack in a can. No, bacon. Yum. She says that as she Yeah, up right? Bacon. I'm just bacon in this, is a, this is a strip <laughs> What is that? I never heard of Scrapple. It's like breakfast spam. Oh, oh. Scrapple. Okay, we're back from breakfast. And we are on our next hunt in the Boy Scout camp. There's Emmy Lyman 24, Mikey. And there's Ozzy Darren. And I'm not sure where Audra is, but there's Rachel, Jersey History Hunters. And my partner in crime is ahead of me. So I'll get back to you on the first find. Okay. Yeah, my first hole, it is a deep hole. I'll get in the sun so you can see this. The 1940 something weedy. Okay. It says one cent. Cool. If I can find a weedy, maybe I can find my white whale, the Merc. I just came upon this medium sized guy. See? The gardener snake. There we go. It doesn't sound like anybody had much luck in the Boy Scout woods. So the, now they're out detecting at the beach. It's Ricky with the snorkel on. You see Mikey with the towel on his head. Oop. And that's Rachel leaning down with her scooped. Yeah, with her pinpointer trying to find something. And I'm not sure where Audra is. And I think that's Audra? That's Audra over on the dock. And Ozzy and Ryan are in the paddle boat somewhere. Now I see what Audra was doing on the dock. She was magnet fishing. Mikey and Rachel are still working on it. When I went on the 13 YouTube channel collaboration hunt that Emmy Lyman 24 and Wild Man's Lodge put on last weekend, um, it, I had a great time. I had an absolute great time. So, one of the first gifts that I received was from Drum and Detect Joel, and he gave me two of his YouTube stickers. So, very nice. I'll be putting one of these on my sticker raincoat, Joel. And if you get a chance, I'll put a picture of his homepage up in the corner here. It's Drum and Detect, and he metal detects. So, there's that. That was the first gift I received when I was there. Um, now, this box was a gift from Ozzy, Ozzy Darren, and I love it. It's a finds box to keep in your car when you're doing multiple hunts and then you can separate stuff. You know, empty your bag, put the good finds in this box. And uh, Ozzy gave this to me the last day before we left. So thank you very much, Ozzy. I love it, I'm using it. So, I'll put Ozzy Darren's picture of his homepage up in the corner as well. So, a gift that I received when we got to the parking lot to meet the others came from Josh of CT Relic Digger, and he gave me my lucky coin one side. And 
There's the other side. I have to research it to find out where it's from. Very nice. It brought me good luck, Josh. Um, after the dig, when we got back and we're barbecuing, Not Right Johnny gave me a flat button. And it looks like it has some kind of writing on the back. I can't make it out. A little bit of gold gild on it. And a Tom back button, which I've never dug. Tom back button. Thank you very much, Johnny. And uh, if you get a chance, check out Not Right Johnny's channel. And I'll put a picture of his homepage up in the corner as well. Um, next, I got a gift from M.A. Lyman 24. It says USA on it. I can't read the other part. It's a Tootsie, I believe. I think it says Tootsie inside there. Look at that. I love it, Mike. And Mike also gave me a hat from the casino. It's got the casino writing on it. Ah, uh, what else do I have here? I think that's all my gifts. And then, of course, the biggest gift of all was a cabin to stay in, which was provided by Ricky of Wild Man's Lodge. Thank you very much, Rick. I really appreciate that. We all had some great finds. We really did. Um, I've got my best find in, best two finds in here. But this was my best find. And it turned out almost looking like brand new. I mean, Mike's Mike bought one online, but I just couldn't believe the back mark on this. It was great. That was my best find. And there's my second best find. Part of a very early suspender clip. And when I spoke with Henry of the Stealth Diggers, Keebs, he said that is early 1800s is his guess on this. My best historical finds. My best finds were all my YouTube friends that I've been talking to for months now, over a year. I finally got to meet them all. So anyhow, I wanted to keep this short. So thank you very much for watching and I'll see you soon.